This video is to demonstrate the interaction between magnets and water. What we have here is a plastic dish with water in it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to drop into it a magnet. Now, what you can't necessarily tell is that the uh, water is a whole lot deeper than the magnet. There from the side you can see through the plastic to see the fact that the water should be crossing over that magnet. In fact the water is about a sixteenth of an inch deeper than the magnet and if I push down the magnet I can get the water to come across. If I pull the water across with my finger but basically what it shows is the fact that the water will do anything to get away from that magnet. Sometimes if you're lucky you can get it to bead up in the middle. Basically what you're seeing is the fact that the water avoids a magnetic field. Or in theory you could, uh, here we go, that shows it really good. The water is literally standing up about a sixteenth of an inch all the way around the magnet. I wonder if you could see me pull it across with my finger. Yep. It's kind of confusing to the eye because it doesn't make sense. But yes, water is affected by a magnet. The water will avoid the magnet and pull away from it. And there you have I can't believe the lighting really shows that. The fact that the surface of the water is dented downwards around the magnet. And I know it looks like an optical illusion or something, but it is for real. A magnet will really push water away from it. Or water will move away from a magnet. An application of this principle might be to keep your basement dry. Now I take an awful lot of magnets. <laughs> Anyways, there we are, the interaction between a magnet and water.